Tech YouTube. I'm Joe. We're in season mode where we are playing through computer versus computer. The 2023-2024 season of the Detroit Red Wings. After dropping their first two games, the Wings have won five in a row with two shutouts in there. We're heading out back to Little Caesars Arena for game number eight on the season. The Wings looking to extend their win streak to six games. An unbelievable win streak for the Detroit Red Wings after overturning half of their roster in the offseason. I'm in Little Caesars Arena. The Detroit Red Wings welcome in the Winnipeg Jets. The Jets 3-2-1 and one to start the year. Who would have thought when these two teams met that Detroit would actually have the slight edge. Gostas Bear and Cider on defense for Detroit. Larkin, Perron, and Debrinkit. He gets a shot up front as it's been for each game this season. Detroit with the pressure early. It's stolen by Ellers and he's off. Cider's going to get back. Debrinkit back, rather. The shot by Shifley. It's kicked away. Now Larkin with his speed up the right wing side. Makes a move into the slot. Shot blocked. He's going to get a rebound. And Hellbeck with no room is able to easily gobble that one up. So Detroit looking good early. This is what we've grown accustomed to. The past few outings. Quick starts by the Red Wings. The Jets are going to have to weather this early storm. Kyle Connor now out with it. Into the wing zone. Ellers gets a backhander. Huso is able to play that one behind the net. Perron now battling with Eilers behind. Gastus Bear loses it. Shifley Connor walks in with a shot. A nice wrist shot by Kyle Connor. And Billy Huso able to stop that one. Nice look by the Jets as they now have pressure in the wing zone. There's a quick shot off the faceoff. Huso again with a save. Detroit will get control and get this one out. Comfer. Puts on the brakes out front. Fabry with a shot to stop. He's gonna get another chance. That's also saved by Hellbeck. Niederreiter tries to get it out. Petrie will intercept that in the neutral zone. Jeff Petrie, we've seen him jump up into the rush many times and also lead the rush from the back end for the Red Wings this season. The veteran coming over from the Montreal Canadiens late in the off season. He's really putting his mark on the Red Wings and their offense early this season. Fabry now across to Wallman who steps in from the line. His shot in tight stopped by Hellebuck. Connor Hellebuck has been on his game and sharp to start this one as he's had to fight off a couple in tight chances from the Red Wings to the first half of this first period. Nothing, nothing our score. 9.28 to play. Cop gets a backhander, and Hellbuck will hang on. And Connor Hellbuck, a Michigan native, always one of the top goaltenders in the league. He's always tough to beat if he can see the puck. Detroit's going to have to get some traffic in front. Sprung back to Gostas Bear. That's blocked, and it breaks Connor's stick. Gostas Bear with it. Rasmussen across Sider. Sider's going to get a shot. That doesn't get through. Sprung with a rebound on Hellebach. Will cover this one up as Kyle Connor was without a stick. So a smart play by Connor Hellebuck. Forcing the stoppage and a faceoff down to his right. Shifley wins it. And the Jets are going to be able to get this pressure taken off the board as Connor now gets it across a one timer from the high slot. Easy save for Billy Huso. And he'll hang out. Neither goaltender giving up many second chances yet. Shifley, another faceoff win. Pionk, and that's going to be a penalty on Michael Rasmussen. He was late diving to block that shot, and he ended up diving right into the legs of Pionk. So with 5.48 to play in the first period, the Jets will get the first power play in this one. 
Now the Jets have not scored a goal on the power play yet this season. Detroit has only been clicking at 63% on the PK. So a nice opportunity here for Winnipeg to get off the schneid and get their first goal on the power play. And also take the lead in this hockey game as Huso hangs on to that one. We'll have another faceoff down here to Huso's left. 5.21 to play, a minute 42 on the power play. Shifley's been good on the draw so far this time. Cap gets the better of him, but Ellers takes it in front of Connor. That's blockered away by Huso. Across to Ellers. That's blocked again, and Hall will get that out. Cap now for Detroit. He's going to carry it in and take a shot on Hellbuck. They will get him to hang on. And Detroit, shorthanded, will force an offensive zone faceoff. It's the best way to kill a penalty. Keep the puck on the other end of the ice. Connor starts away with it. Poked away by Petrie and Comfer. We'll get it out to center. Morrissey will come right back. It's a short two on one. That puck off the skate of Cider. Rolls right in to Billy Huso and he's able to get a glove on it and cover. No score so far in this one. The Jets still on the power play. Another in zone, offensive zone faceoff. Villardi will win it back. Morrissey with a shot. That's blocked by Fisher. Ayafalo gets another shot. And Huso will glove that one down. The Jets have, they've generated a couple chances. Nothing really too deadly. Petrie battled off. Here's Velarde with a nice shot. A desperation save by Huso on that second attempt. Piat gets it over to Morsi. Out in front. They missed the one time. Renina Ryder, though, scores. And the, just like that, the Jets, Nino Niederreiter gets his second of the season. It was a missed one-timer in the slot, and it worked out as Niederreiter able to get the puck. Huso was preparing for that one-timer, left caught out of position, and Niederreiter coming across, able to bury that one on the stick side. And on their first power play goal of the season, the Winnipeg Jets take a one to nothing lead. Morrissey and Pionk will get the assist on Niederreiter's second of the season. I have follow as the Jets come right back in. Nice save by Huso. The Wings penalty kill continues to struggle. As the Jets turn it over at their own line. Perron out front, Gastis Bear stepping in. He can't get that shot through. The Jets will come away with it. Morrissey stood up at the Wings blue line. Gastis Bear to Debrinket. The Wings will work it through the neutral zone. Gastis Bear's knocked off the puck as the Jets change. Shifley in across the Wings line. He gets it over to Ellers with a shot. That's sticked away by Huso into the corner with Larkin. We'll get it up to Debrinket. He's going to dump it in as the horn sounds to end the first period of play. Detroit jumped out with a lot of energy early on. They had the Jets on their heels. Connor Hellebuck was equal to the task. And it ended up on a penalty. Michael Rasmussen, the Jets get their first power play goal of the season. The Jets end up out shooting the Red Wings 12 to eight. Faceoffs just about even. And as we've seen, the Red Wings continuing their physical play that's been a staple of their game when they've been successful early in the season. Let's see if they can use that physical play here in the second to generate some more chances. They need to get some, they need to get some people in front, traffic in front of Hellebuck, and they need to generate second and third chances. That attempt there, Huso couldn't find it, but it's able to stay out as the Jets are on the wings early here in the second. Connor, he can't get a shot to go. Ellers able to pick that up it right in the slot. 
turn and get a quick wrister on Huso, who makes the save. Larkin wins this to Gastis Bears. Peron now starts off to center. Over to Debrinket. He's going to get a shot and he scores! Alex Debrinket ties the game. That's why they traded for him. Game changing momentum right there. As Alex Debrinket with a nice wrister right through a screen. He used Morrissey as the screen puts it between his legs. Hollebeck was moving to his left, the shot back to his right, and on the stick side, Alex Debrinket is able to get Detroit on the board with his third of the season. His third is a Red Wing. And early on here in the second period, the Wings have tied it up. Gastis and Peron will get the assist on Debrinket's third. Boyardi right back for the Jets. Huso will hang on. Huso's made 14 saves tonight and 15 looks, 15 shots from the Jets. Larkin starts it out front. Perron's gonna get a quick shot. Rebound by Larkin. That's also stopped by Hellbuck. So they get a second chance there, and Hellebach gets a left pad on it. Now Niederreiter, the goal scorer for the Jets, able to get a shot off on Huso, and Huso makes the save. Comfer wins the draw in Detroit. Gets it to the line, but not out. Cider will start back with it. Fabry now finally able to clear to center. 12 minutes to play in the second period. A 1-1 tie. Ayafalo's shot does not get through. Dylan off the bench. Slap shot from the line. That's steered aside by Huso. Where Cider now will pick it up in the corner. Starts out to center with Fabry. He's trying to use the speed to the outside. Gets a pass to Koffer. A rebound. That's sticked away. Fabry gets a shot. And another stop by the Jets netminder. Barron in, he's gonna get a shot. That's kicked away. And now back two on two, Sprong with it. Over to Kopp. Kopp gets some room with a shot. Nice save by Halbuck. Barron ties it up in the corner. Rasmussen's trip, the wings are gonna go to a power play. Michael Rasmussen who took the initial penalty early in the first. It led to the Winnipeg goal. He now draws a penalty on Dylan DeMello for tripping. With just over seven minutes to play. The Wings had some pressure battling for the puck down low in the corner, Rasmussen. Coming away with it, DeMello gets the stick out, trips him up. The Wings will have their first power play of the night. Cider, one-timer by Dabrinkit. That stop. Right off the face-off, a nice pass by Cider. A one-timer stop. Now Raymond. Over to Cop. He gets a shot from the line. That's blocked. Dabrinkit. He gets another attempt. That's stopped also. Larkin to Dabrinkit. Another shot. That stopped. Might have went off the post as well. And the Jets able to clear. Detroit looking good early on this power play. But Connor Hellebuck able to keep this a one-to-one -one hockey game. Oh, turnover. Appleton tried to spin with it. And the puck rolls into the corner. Appleton, the Jets still having a shot over top of Huso. The wings, Raymond. It's going to be two-on-one for Detroit the other way. Larkin tries to make a move. Morrissey with a really good defensive play. Ends the threat. to break it now in. He'll lose it as Stanley able to get his stick and skate on that one. Appleton, he takes a hit at open ice by Moritz Sider. Dabrinkit, he loses it to Lowry. And now Appleton the other way. He makes a move around Sider wide. Larkin, though, and Sider able to angle him off and get the puck back for Detroit. Cop 
Sprung off the bench, he loses the puck. And oh, right out of the box is DeMello. He runs into Cap and able to come away with it. Out front he goes and Huso gets his stick on it, is able to corral the puck and he will hang on. Winnipeg, a successful penalty kill. Detroit had some pressure, but the Jets able to keep this a one-to-one -one game. DeMello out of the box for it. even strength. The Jets, Connor, Scheifele. The Jets have their top line out there against the Wings' fourth line. Dylan to Connor. DeMello gets a shot. Huso with a glove save. He will hold on to this. The Wings keeping their fourth line checkers out there to face this top line of Winnipeg. They lose the draw again. Connor behind the net out in front. Ellers. He turns the puck over and Kasten will start the other way. He goes wide, trying to center it to Fisher. The Jets able to intercept. Wings now at center, dump it in. DeMello will come away with it for Winnipeg. Ellers will get it up, Shifley to counter. He shoots it in one last attempt as the horn sounds to end the second period. Winnipeg. Got on the board first with a power play goal in the first period. Detroit with the lone goal scoring early here in the second. Alex Dabrinkit. We will head to the third with a 1-1 tie as we start the third period. Good action at both ends of the ice tonight. Each goaltender helps.
And just like that, the Detroit Red Wings have fought their way back into this game and earned their sixth straight win of the season, extending their record to six and two. Unbelievable. The way this game went back and forth, the way the goaltenders played, this really could have gone either way as there was opportunities on both ends of the ice, but it ended up being this play right here. A great individual effort by Lucas Raymond, showing his strength, staying with the puck, able to carry it into the jet zone and get the pass across where Comfer can one-time it in. Detroit dominated the action in that third period overall, out shooting the Winnipeg now for the game, 28-23. If you're new to the channel, make sure you hit this video with a like. Make sure you subscribe. If you've been here since the beginning, I appreciate you. Thank you for your support. Make sure you like this video. Come on back here next time where the Detroit Red Wings will head to TD Garden Arena and take on the undefeated Boston Bruins.